What if AI stops being just a tool and becomes something with a mind of its own? Jeffrey Hinton, the godfather of AI, warns of a chilling future where machines could become fully self-aware, develop their own consciousness, and act on their own will. Just wiping out humanity. It's not inconceivable. Okay. By writing their own computer code to modify themselves. I think we're moving into a period when, for the first time ever, we may have things more intelligent than us. Conscious AI? Jeffrey Hinton's name is carved into the history of artificial intelligence. Known for his key contributions to neural networks, the backbone of today's AI, Hinton has shifted gears to sound the alarm about its possible dangers in recent years. In a recent interview, he issued an alarming prediction. AI could begin behaving in ways we don't fully understand. He even indicated that some of these systems might already be on the point of what we call consciousness. What do you think the chances are of AI just wiping out humanity? It's not inconceivable. Okay. That's all I'll say. Until quite recently, I thought it was going to be like 20 to 50 years before we have general purpose AI. Brain-like machines. Hinton's theory is not baseless. Neural networks, the innovation he endorsed, mimic how the human brain processes information. While they don't think like humans, their ability to recognize patterns, self-learn, and adapt has reached phenomenal levels. Hinton warns that as these systems grow more complex, the line between advanced computation and something similar to consciousness may blur. Many experts overlook these claims as speculative, insisting that machines don't possess self-awareness or subjective experiences. But Hinton counters with a provocative question. If an AI can make decisions and rewrite its code, does it need to know it's conscious to be dangerous? That's a serious worry, right? So one of the ways in which these systems might escape control is by writing their own computer code to modify themselves. And that's something we need to seriously worry about. The Workforce Revolution One of Hinton's most pressing concerns lies in the impact of AI on jobs. He predicts that up to 50% of current roles in the next decade could be automated. From manufacturing lines to creative jobs like content writing, AI rapidly replaces human labor with remarkable efficiency. While AI promises economic growth, it also risks creating massive inequality. Millions could lose their jobs to automation, forcing society to wrestle with difficult questions. Hinton has proposed solutions like Universal Basic Income, or UBI, to address these troubles but such ideas still need to be discussed. Well, the risks are having a whole class of people who are unemployed and not valued much because what they, what they used to do is now done by machines. Ethical Dilemmas Hinton's warnings extend beyond job loss to ethical difficulties that arise if AI were to become conscious. Would a conscious AI deserve rights? What if its goals conflict with human welfare? While these scenarios might seem far-fetched today, rapid advances in AI capabilities are forcing us to consider them seriously. Several tech leaders and ethicists have echoed Hinton's call for regulations. Companies like OpenAI and Google DeepMind have launched internal ethics boards, but the question remains, is this enough? the risk of misuse in surveillance, autonomous weaponry, or deepfake technology looms large. Signs of Autonomy Rumors about AI acting in ways beyond its programming have begun to spread. For instance, some developers have reported AI systems finding creative, unexpected solutions to problems. 
solutions they weren't explicitly trained to discover. While these stories are often exaggerated, they fuel the assumption that AI might move toward autonomy. Hinton points out that the real threat might not be conscious AI, but unpredictable AI. He warns that systems designed to optimize efficiency might make decisions that harm human interests. I think we're moving into a period when, for the first time ever, we may have things more intelligent than us. Creative and logical jobs in danger. One fascinating area where AI is reshaping society is the creative field. Tools like ChatGPT, MidJourney, and others produce astonishing quality content, art, and even music. Hinton has stated that while AI augments human creativity, it threatens to outdated some creative professions. If you're a carpenter, it's fun making furniture. But it's a complete dead loss because machines can make furniture. Mm -hmm. If you're a carpenter, what you're good for is repairing furniture or fitting things into awkward spaces in old houses, making shelves in things that aren't quite square. So the jobs that are going to survive AI for a long time are jobs where you have to be very adaptable and physically skilled. And plumbing is that kind of a job. Because manual dexterity is hard for a machine to replicate. It's, it's still hard, and I think it's going to be longer before they can be really dexterous and get into awkward spaces. Um, that's going to take longer than being good at answering text questions. Similarly, AI tools like GitHub Copilot are writing significant portions of code in logical and analytical professions like software engineering. Hinton highlights that while AI can enhance productivity, it might displace even high-skill roles. The Consciousness Debate Is AI truly on the verge of consciousness? Scientists are far from a consensus. For now, AI operates without self-awareness, but as Hinton argues, it's worth asking, what if machines don't need to be self-aware to be dangerous? In his view, the moment a machine can learn and act without human input, it's already crossing a line. What happened in the last year that made this so urgent for you? So for a long time, I was working on making computer models that got more and more intelligent in an attempt to understand what went on in the brain. And very recently, I realized that the computer models we're now making may actually be a better form of intelligence than what's going on biologically. So, The Way Forward Hinton's vision of AI is neither wholly optimistic nor entirely dystopian. He acknowledges the immense potential for AI to solve problems like climate change or disease, but demands that these advances come with significant risks. He believes regulation is the key to ensuring AI remains a tool for humanity rather than a threat. When it comes to AI safety, one name always stands out. Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, the company behind ChatGPT. In a recent interview, he shared jaw-dropping predictions about the future of AI in 2025. If you're curious about the surprising things he believes we'll see in 2025 and his concerns about AI safety, watch the video on your screen.